She is the highest expression of heritage and contemporaneity from the world's most famous shipyard. This is Riva 102 Corsero Super. Riva's story evolves with a sporty super yacht distinguished by spaces that enhance contact with the outdoors. A unique, unmistakable profile, elegant and resolute in asserting her identity with the large windows running along the hull and the raised pilot house with a racy profile that emphasizes the bold character. She has an overall length of 30.24 meters and a maximum beam of 6.7 meters. Extensive space is devoted to the flybridge, which has an area of 43 square meters. A decor of refined aesthetic lightness reflects the ability to interpret luxury in a contemporary way. In the aft area, we find freestanding sofa and furnishings in delicate colors. Under the hardtop, there is a cocktail bar and alfresco dining area. The external helm station has two 16-inch touchscreen chart plotters. From here, there is immediate access to the interior raised pilot house or through an electric door and companionway on the port side to the forward area. The multi-level bow living area with its 17 square meters offers various convivial and serene relaxation situations. There is an extra sized sun pad and a forward panoramic sofa. Materials, colors and shapes of every furniture and accessory have that marine flavor and elegance that Riva has always given to its products. The pilot house is located in a raised position and provides the captain with top-of-the-line instrumentation, including the Simrad Command Loop Navigation System that integrates onboard monitoring and navigation and maneuvering instruments to manage the entire yacht from the five 19-inch GPS chart plotters. It can be accessed either from the flybridge or the companionway on the main deck. The environment is completed by a living area. Riva 102 Corsero Super is equipped with HydroTab interceptor trim correctors with automatic features to ensure maximum ease of use and reduced fuel consumption. Sleepner's vector fins are used to minimize roll at anchor and while underway, and one Seakeeper NG9 and one NG18 are used upon request to further increase stability and thus comfort. The beach deck covers an area of 15 square meters and is designed for relaxing in contact with the sea on the extra large sunbed and the lowered full beam beach deck. The large garage houses the jet ski and a Williams 445 tender. Launching and hauling procedures are fast and agile. The cockpit is a true lounge on the sea, elegant and functional. Its 20 square meters accommodate a long fixed sofa to which freestanding furnishings such as designer chairs and a teak dining table or coffee table can be combined. The bar cabinet is completed with an ice maker. Next to the technical maneuvering area, the sea bob can be arranged. The lounge on the main deck is a 34 square meter area with ample room for movement. The unmistakable Reva style gives us an enchantment of living surrounded by inimitable beauty and class. Polished surfaces and frames create magnificent reflections, sometimes bright, sometimes muted, as in the lacquered ceilings in a satin titanium hue. To meet the needs of owners, two layouts are available. In the standard version, the dining area is located aft and in the living area toward the bow. Side doors are located on both sides. Alternatively, the lounge area is placed at the entrance and the dining table is located near the kitchen. The 75-inch maxi screen is set in a magnificent opaque bulkhead crossed by lines of polished steel. On the starboard side, the access to the galley and on the port side, the entrance to the master cabin. The galley is 11 square meters in area. The bulkhead, lining, the appliances, including the American fridge, are of brushed stainless steel. Next to the extendable dining table is access to the crew quarters. The left side of the main salon leads to the spacious and elegant master cabin, which is full beam in the forward area. The king-size bed stands out in the center of the cabin, 
with a black leather headboard resting against a matte black wall crossed by polished steel profiles. A triangular section desk serves as a desk facing the sea. The master cabin is complemented by a spacious walk-in closet with full-height doors and back-painted glass. Opposite the bed is a bulkhead in which the TV is inserted. Huge side glazing illuminates the 26 square metres of the master suite, giving the feeling of even more space. The dormouse overlooks the sea and lets the gaze run to infinity. The full beam bathroom is furnished with a double sink and black or white marble cabinet. On the sides, the toilet area and shower compartments, respectively. On the lower deck are the guest quarters, which include three double VIP cabins and one stateroom with twin beds. Each has its own ensuite bathroom, made with the same materials and fittings as the owners. In the bow, the crew area consists of the captain's cabin with ensuite bathroom and two other cabins with bunk beds for the sailors that share a head. On the new Riva 102 Corsaro Super, the owner can choose to install a pair of MTU 16-valve 2000 M96 engines of 2,435 mph each for a maximum speed of 26 knots and 23 knots cruising. Alternatively, a pair of MTU 16-valve 2000 M96L engines rated at 2,638 mph each can be installed to achieve 28 knots maximum speed and 24 knots cruising. Riva 102 Casaro Super, an icon of style and luxury 